happens in between. Pretty much like this. If you want a Christmas day, I can give you a cup of cocoa. If I catch obscure management for making us shower with cold water at 7 a.m., it's not gonna be nice. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me Uto Wotela Wendlebe and I hope that you guys are doing well. And before we get into this video, please don't forget to comment, like and subscribe to my channel. So today is my first day, not so first day of the semester. Well, I started last week, but not officially. So yeah, I think this week is like the official first day of the semester, second semester. Um, I have a clinic at like 12 1 p.m so i just want to quickly make breakfast and then i want to go to the library start working on some lectures so that i'm not behind for my wednesday lecture so yeah that's just the plan for today and so i have two clinical blocks this semester no not this semester this term um i have electrophysiology which is the one that I'm going to attend at 1 p.m. And then I also have Dev School Management. I'm honestly looking forward to that one because I just wanna be in a situation that's going to test my sign language skills. So basically we're gonna be taken to Dev Schools and we're gonna have to work with those children and manage those children. So I'm really excited for that block. But yeah, in in general, there's no time to smile. It's time for business now. Like. I'm only going to smile in November when I go back home. So without wasting any time, let us get into the vlog. So I'm in the kitchen right now and I'm about to make jungle oats because the only thing that makes sense is breakfast. and the electricity is going at we have load shedding at 6 p.m in about two hours so i just want to quickly cook something so that by the time the electricity goes um i just heat up my food and take a nap or something <laughs> Christmas to give you control 
find the best lighting but i think this is the best i can get because it's still like very early in the morning but hi guys it's a tuesday morning i'm on my way to campus because i have to go catch transport to clinics um it's my first day of the deaf school management block i'm really looking forward to that one um i'll definitely update you guys how the clinic went i don't know if i'm gonna take you guys along because i mean most of the time we're not allowed to vlog and stuff but if i can capture a few moments here and there then that's that but if i can't i'm sorry Sometime has passed since I came back from my clinic. I came back like an hour or two ago. I attended one of my lectures online and I made food while attending my lecture. I really just want to say that the clinic that I'm currently, like the block that I'm currently covering is quite an interesting block, especially if you're a person that went to mainstream schooling and you get to see um, how children interact in deaf schools i think like it's quite interesting and it's also very it's a very different environment i'm not gonna lie um in between the clinic we also got to observe like a sign language lesson like a sign language class where the children were being like given story times in sign language and to me that was the first and it was so interesting to see kids as little as like grade r understanding like a story in sign language like to me that was so interesting to watch and them actually and their teacher actually asking them questions in sign language and them responding in sign language i think that was just like amazing because most of the time i was just like lost i don't know what was going on in the story time i was just looking at the pictures and those kids literally understood everything they were being taught morning guys it's a wednesday i'm in the kitchen and i'm trying to like make a smoothie that's essentially going to be my breakfast because I really don't have time to make proper breakfast because my class starts in like 15-20 minutes so I really just have to rush through this and get to campus <laughs> to the last one which is the four d's so you've got dysphagia dysmetria diphobia and dysarthria hi guys so my room is a bit of a mess hence why i woke up today and i decided that i'm gonna have a reset today i'm going to literally take everything down wash my sheets because i mean i do that every week but yeah i'm just gonna extend this one by like washing my carpet my shower curtains and if i still have the energy then i am going to like literally take everything out of the cupboard and rearrange it because right now my ocd is not surviving when my cupboard is looking like this so yeah i'm also going to clean my shower and my toilet like thoroughly thoroughly clean all the walls and yeah and also it's just raining outside so what better way to spend a rainy day than just resetting and cleaning your space Sunday night 
my friends and I are going for dinner at Waterfront Life Grand Cafe and really just decided to dress up and look like city girls. City girl. Here she is, city girl number one. Imagine blocky. Yeah, city girl number two. So, yeah, that's the life and that's the level. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, just got in town. Then I won't let you in this cloud. It's all in the sky. Ruin my vibe. Usually I don't do this often But since recruiting isn't an option Do you want you in all that you do please don't like things because it's raining now and we're literally wearing heels and we're getting oh. rained on Just say you will, will, will come through and chill, chill, chill. Just say you will. I wish you were mine. Best of Shalasongi weekend. Buza Hamba Monday. Buza Shalumen with TV. Buza Kwam. Oh, dear Tan and Tanaman. So I'm saying, I wish you were mine. Best of Shalasongi weekend. Buza Hamba Monday.